Hi, a few years ago I wanted to build a fully automated website to see how much money it could make me. Now that website makes me around $1000 per month. And in this video I want to show you how I did it. If you want to make passive money online, building the website will probably be the easiest step. But getting the traffic and convincing people to click the buy button on your website will be much harder. To earn enough trust from your visitors to click the buy button on your website, it has to look great. If people don't trust your website, they just leave immediately. So you should not underestimate this part, it's really important. Luckily, I got help from my wife to do this. She made a minimalistic and super awesome design for the site. If you're not good at design yourself, you should get help from someone or just buy a theme online. It doesn't cost too many dollars. Let's say you have built a nice website that people can use and trust. How do you get people to come to you? 99% of my traffic comes from Google. The content of my website is actually quite thin, so I'm not sure why my products appear in the search results so often. And they often appear higher up than the original store that I get information and products from. I tried a little bit of guest blogging and similar to get backlinks because backlinks can really help you boost the search results ranking. But that takes a lot of time and effort, so I haven't done it too much. I also had a lot of patience with the website. For the first year I almost didn't have any traffic at all. And now I have between three and 400 visitors coming daily from Google alone. So that's the thing to keep in mind when you're just getting started. It takes a lot of time, so you need patience and you don't quit too soon, because the traffic will come. To earn money on the website, I just forward the users to a real webshop. And then the webshop notice that the visitors are coming from me and I get a little cut of the sale. This is usually between 4 and 12%. Some days are good and some days are not. There can be days when I don't sell anything and there can be days when I make a sale for $250 in one sale. And that's when you celebrate. There are tons of different niches you can choose between. I chose interior because I like interior. I also had a site for clothes. But the problem with that site was that there are so many people who just send clothes back to the store and then I lose my cut. One thing to keep in mind is also that you should not put all of your eggs in one basket. All of a sudden one of the shops could stop or affiliate cuts or some, something similar. You should try to use multiple web shops from different affiliate networks. By googling you will probably find many because there are a ton of different networks and shops out there. By the way, if you like this video, I would be really happy if you click like below. This would help me grow the channel. And if you want more content like this, you need to subscribe to my channel as well. Before I continue, I just want to say thanks to my Patreons. When I registered as an affiliate, I got access to XML feeds for the products. There are information about everything you need. I couldn't import this one by one, so I had to write a few Python scripts myself, where I looped through the data and put the products in the correct categories and similar. The hardest part about this script was to make it customizable so it could fit all the different XML feeds from the different shops. Many of them are good and some are really bad. So you need to make sure that your website isn't filling up with unnecessary information like weird ca characters and similar. My website has around 10 different shops and 60,000 products. It, it would be impossible for me to update all of them at once or manually. So to help me with this I had to build a few more Python scripts. So every night my bots download the newest XML feeds and then find new products, check for prices, offers and similar. Creating the Python scripts and running them every night is actually really easy. I use something called Chrome Jobs to do this. The website runs on a relatively small server which cost me only around $10 per month. So there's not a lot of expenses to this either. If you want to learn how to build websites you need to click this video to get an introduction to Django. I hope you liked this video and if you did please click like below. If you want more content like this you need to subscribe to my channel and also remember to click the bell. See you next time.